Hello, my beautiful Capricorn Dragons. Welcome to your September reading. First of all, I'd like to invite you to please like, subscribe, leave comments. I'm going to be giving away this deck at the end of September. It is the Tarot of Dreams. I have a new one that I am re-energizing. And this one is time for it to retire. So, um, yeah. So I'm giving it away to you guys. So, yeah. So... Whatever, I'm going to be doing it in October, so, but I need to know, you know, that you're interested and, um, and how to connect with you so that, um, so that I can get it to you. So you also have to be comfortable with that as well, right? Like you're going to have to give me your information. So just keep that in mind. Okay, guys. So, cause I know not everybody's comfortable with that and that's fine. Um, so let's see. We have Soulmates, Milk and Honey, and By the Book. Guys, right now, this seems pretty, pretty good. It's, it's like, it's almost like everything's falling into place the way that it should be, right? Like, it's, um, and I'm not saying that it was an easy time getting here. It's funny. Um, have you ever had put, like, a lot of hard work into something, and you were successful, and then somebody looks at you, and as something to really tear down all the hard work you've done by saying something like, oh, well, it must be nice to blah, 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 right? And it's just like, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. Like, you didn't see the hours, the months, the years that it took for this person to get into this situation, right? Like, to, to, to actually finally be... Um, doing this, right? Even finding soulmates, right? Like that takes a lot of internal work, right? If you haven't been brought up in a healthy household, and those are very few and far between these days, there's so much unhealed generational trauma that gets passed on um, just with a different mask. Um, there's so much healing. So for you to find soulmates and have milk and honey, like that's everything nourishing and sweet. And um, by the book, it's like, it's like you just did, you knew how to do it. And you did. And that's beautiful. Okay, I'm not taking all those though. Okay, I'll do one more shuffle and I'm pretty sure I saw a card flip. Just trying to see if there is a flip card in there and there isn't so let's go ahead and pull this out so we have the six of cups and this is sort of in the past you might have um not hooked up with not in that sense you might have um had a reunion with somebody from the past you might have either been thinking about it or maybe they did come back in um this is also about meeting a soulmate again this goes hand in hand with the, this card um, it does mean going back though. So it could have been somebody that you knew from childhood, um, or doesn't even have to be childhood, just sometime previous in your life. Let's see. So we have, so yeah, it's almost like something's happened and you're not announcing it in a big way. You're having a small victory with it. And it's like, it's, there was something unfair that happened and it's flipping around. It's becoming fair again the justice is here. So it's almost like you put out and you know, that little speech that I just gave you guys about, um, all the hard work that you've put in, you've made, you put in the good and now you're receiving the good back or you will be if you haven't. Okay. You're going to be celebrating. It's not going to be massive celebrations. This is just going to be very quiet. Okay. It's going to be a little bit more modest. Um, but everything is good, right? Um, it's, 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 it could be, um, even, and I don't want to wreck the surprise. It could even be, um, a surprise to you that this happens. Okay. So now that being said, okay, because this is what I hate about tarot readings is just because I say this, it's going to be a surprise to you. Do not sit around and wait for somebody to come around. Okay. Do not continue to live your life. If this person is meant to come back, because don't forget this is a general reading, then they will. No matter what you do, this person will come back if they're meant to, okay? 
So just don't, don't sit and wait. Don't stop your life. We have the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Um, it, it's almost like, um, it's funny because this comes in, but it's almost like you feel stuck. Just a second, guys. Let me get a read because this is like a good positive energy. Knight of coins in reverse and the six of coins, excuse me, in reverse. Yeah. You were stuck and you're recovering. That's what it is. You're recovering from somebody who um, might have been greedy. Yeah, you, yeah, okay, this is, it's, it's sort of very back and forth, but let me see if I can best describe it to you, because you have the hermit in reverse and the priestess in the upright, okay? So, it's almost like you refused to stand down. You refused to retreat. You stayed in the game. You stayed um, where you should be, right? So even though you might have been lonely, right? And even though you sort of kept busy, you knew what you were doing, right? You you knew it because you did that, but you you knew what your base was all along with this priestess, okay? You were slowly taking your power back. You were using your intuition when you did this. Okay. You might've been meditating and that's good. You have the five of swords in reverse, right? And you knew that you were the only person that could get you out of whatever the situation was. And this is why this is here. This is sort of a whole background story to this. Right. This is sort of the Cole's Notes version. Do those still exist? This is the quick version. This is the background. You're the one that created this justice in your life. You're the one that's going to be celebrating. It's not going to be loud. It's not going to be huge, but that's okay. Okay. No, that's too many. There's a King of Swords that came up back here. You could have been dealing with somebody who was a um, an air sign. Now, the King, it's upright. Okay, so this person's very logical, analytical. They might have been a, a leader or something, but they're very truthful. Okay, they, they have lots of integrity. And I think that's why this works out. Because this wasn't, um, this isn't in reverse. For the first time in many readings, it isn't somebody who's toxic. It's just that there was something that had to be taken care of. Yeah, look, the hermit is in the upright here. So by not going in, you knew why you weren't doing it, but then you actually created this much deeper connection inside. Oh my gosh, you guys are getting like all major arcana. This is crazy. So over here we have the empress. You're creating, you know you're creating something new. You know that you're nourishing it. You're nourishing yourself, right? Seven of Swords. I just said to myself, I'm like, oh my gosh, if this is a major arcana again. So Seven of Swords. You, um, you know that you had the upper hand and you, you took it step by step and you were very mindful with how you did things. Because you didn't want to go back and cause chaos. You wanted things to heal. Because look at this. Way over here landed the Wheel of Fortune. Okay? The way that you've taken care of things and the way that you've done this has created all favorable conditions for you. It's all favorable for you. Right? You've you've did what you've had to do. And this is completely in your favor. It's actually quite beautiful what you've created, right? So first of all, if you haven't, you need to give yourself a pat on the back because this is absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, look, so out here came family and tribe. You know that you're connected to this person. You knew that they were worth um, what you were doing. I mean, you hear fighting for, but it's not really a fight. Home. Oh, guys. Like, it's, you've done everything the way that you needed to. Beauty. 
Yeah, it, it's it's almost like it, it, you're creating this really beautiful life. You guys, this is a, a fantastic reading. So wherever you are in this story, okay, wherever you are in this, okay, you might still be way back here and not knowing what to do, right? Or you might be here and going, okay, well, you know, so it, you've done everything. Maybe you just needed um, a little bit of reassurance that what you're doing is right and what you've done is amazing this is beautiful congratulations capricorn i think this is probably one of the best readings i've ever done it isn't filled with a ton of crazy insane happiness but it's a good steady happiness and this is this is what we want so congratulations please do like and subscribe remember i am giving away this deck and i will see you um, in your next reading. Thanks, guys.